unto the children of Israel and bid them that they make them fringes in the borders of their garments throughout their generations and that they put upon the fringe of the borders a ribbon of blue. And it shall be unto you for a fringe that you may look upon it and remember all the commandments of the Lord and do them that ye may remember and do all my commandments and be holy unto your God. Love, love. I guess the time's right to get my mind right. Locked in my shrine box like I'm Iron Mike. Ironic root from my bulb took me from the limelight. Through the hindsight, ain't no turning back. Uh, no fad, no gimmick, no strings attached. Money conceal a fact that niggas can't really rap. I'm only bitter from the nights I spent my last on it. For niggas to say they ain't rappers but make they cash on it. Or Sean told me that their power won't diminish mine. So I spit Braille magazine so you can feel my vibe. If she ain't woke, or at least I hear trying. Can't court her like I ain't pressing charges for the crime. Scratch that. I can't court her like I got two dimes. She said a head bomb in the past. She had blue minds. Took me softly like Lauren. I can use your head. For new crime, these sentences, sentences of lifetime. You can try to kill me, but you only shoot blanks. Shoot your unk, that's a treasure in the you bank. You can try to kill me, yeah, but you only shoot the blanks. Shoot your unk, that's a treasure in the you bank. You can try to kill me, yeah, but you only shoot the blanks. Shoot your unk, that's a treasure in the you bank. Try to kill me, yeah, but you only shoot the blanks. That's a treasure in the bank. Hold up. Fascination of my thoughts got them gathered in. Channeled in to watch me analyze. Sagarin, great grand Indian. My mama's side, blacker skin. El Nino mixed to cause perfection when I'm tapping in. Two to unk, that's a treasure in the bank. I was lost in that water, found Atlantis when I sank. No prison, but these bars sharp and shores like a shank. For this cold world frosted like layers of a cake. Yeah, my mind stayed in the country that you know of. Remember for my quotes, you trying to be the quota. No coke beehive, I do this shit with no buzz, now who the master, I got the glow showing up, and when I say roll up, I mean in that feeder, when I pop, no soda, but I'm that one leader, my shoulders be so shrug, but ain't about my people, you put that fork in the road, how you surprised that I meet, yeah, yeah, yeah. God talk to him, huh, God talk to him, So, hold up. I know you wish that you could make me disappear for good Because you stuck inside that mindset I don't represent the hood But why would you hate on me if I'm trying to change for good Your insecurities make you forget they dying in the hood In the hood, yeah, well the role models Man, this shit got my soul bothered. They exploiting the art for hood fame. Everything a hustle for little change. Yeah. Niggas selfish, they ain't reaching out to the real artists with no hood clout. Make me question what they do it for. I gotta spit that shit they can't ignore, can't ignore. Tony Dreams, the novel, uh, dropping that end of July, man. Uh, the book actually came from a screenplay. This, this the actual screenplay for it. Uh, I was gonna do it, a, do a movie, but uh, you know it's just a little bit tougher to go through that process of uh, you know getting the funding and all that. So I decided I, I still wanted to get the story out, so I turned it into a book. It took me a while, man. This is three years in the making. 
you know what I mean? A lot of people ask me why I even wrote a book. Um, first off, this, this is me uh, not letting ADD and insomnia control my life. So instead of me just, you know, sitting around and letting it hinder me, I turned into, uh, you know, a strength. So I use that time that I'm up late night or can't sleep or can't pay attention and I focused on something and uh, I made a book. And, and second, the uh, story, you know what I mean, about you know, the people on the street and you know how talented people can be and the conflict they have between you know trying to get out and separating themselves from their friends. It could be tougher than what people think, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you got a lot of geniuses that are actually on the street and they, they look they look down upon because of you know their situation. So I decided to tell that story for them. Uh, so that's what this book about. It's about perspectives of life uh, and the beauty of different perspectives of life if you want to get to understand them. So uh, I just want you to fall in love with the characters and uh, fall in love with the story. And it's going to be a series, so it's going to be more of these. So, man, Daytona Dreams, the novel, late July. Uh, appreciate y'all, man. Daytona Beach, 386, man.